Yo, 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 what is up, guys? And welcome back to another one of my videos. I uh, just filmed the, uh, my first Chrome Hobby Box opening where we pulled this absolutely stunning, beautiful card here. Um, only reason I don't have it in a top loader, guys, is because I literally don't have a top loader that fits the size. It's either too big or too small. Um, so I'm going to have to go to my uh, local card shop and get some top loaders. But, uh, you know, high off the... Uh, the big hit, we're gonna open up my second box uh, that I had of MLS Chrome. And hopefully we can pull some more awesome hits. Um, you know, I like to think I'm always lucky, um, really been really lucky with cards and stuff. And so that's probably a reward for, you know, finishing second place in my fantasy league and not getting winning at all. But I also got extremely lucky in my fantasy league because I literally had the least points against. So, and it was like by like three hundred too. But uh, yeah, can't win them all, I guess. But the messy definitely helps. Um, so, MLS Chrome Hobby. We got twenty packs with four cards each for a total of eighty cards. Uh, last box we got uh, how many parallels did we get? We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven number parallels and autograph. Which this guy's actually pretty good. I looked him up on eBay, so that's how I know. Trust me. Um, which I thought I heard of him before, but you know, I don't like with MLS stuff. I don't like to talk out of my butt because I don't know a ton. Like I said in my last video, I'm a St. Louis collector, not an MLS collector, um, as a whole. So, I, and I've only been getting more into the league recently. It's just nice to have a hometown team to cheer for, and it's also cool to have you know the goat. So, uh. We're looking for case hit cards, probably not another Pearlers in this case, but, you know, Future Stars are in there, there's Image Variations, there's uh, Hidden Gems, there's uh, the one card that's like horizontal that's, I don't know, it, it's weird looking, it looks like it's in a picture frame, but, uh, yeah, and of course, low numbered cards in St. Louis cards as well, so... Right off the bat, we have a Derek Etienne Jr. Green to 75 on the Topps 58 design. If it would let me put it in the top loader, that is. So, nice start there. Love the design of Chrome this year. I just know I'm going to be ripping a ton of this. Hopefully, I can find some blasters and uh, get those for you guys. That'd be cool. Um, 28 is just normal. So here we go. We got Bogus. Bogus. We got Bogus. It's not, I know that's not his name. I'm, don't flame me. I, I'm sure. I, I know. I'm just joking. Unless it actually is. In that case, then disregard everything I just said. But um, we got a, that. And we have a Kramashi to 125. All right. So... Hey. Yuri, Yuri, hey, or Yuri, Kyle, Mikhail, Yuri, or whatever. Um, and we got Kramashi to 125, who I guess is probably be the rookie to get, you know, if you, you know, quote unquote, you know, if you're looking at this, the set from an objective standpoint, you know what, we'll, we'll throw him up there, and, you know, we can replace him if we get something better. Hopefully we do. But, uh, I mean, he's a good midfielder. Don't get me wrong. I mean, he's playing the MLS. I'm sitting here opening his cards. So, I mean, there's levels to stuff, obviously. But, um, yeah, hopefully he does well. Um, but Craig on the Speckle, one per hobby box. I think these are... A really underappreciated parallel. They're really nice. All right. We got Hopkins. This guy, Juninho, free kick master. Used to play for, I didn't even know he ever played for Red Bulls. I know him most from his Lyon, uh, you know, clips that I've seen online of him a lot in. Uh, Olympic Lyon doing crazy, crazy free kicks. Okay, brief stint in 2013. So, 
I mean, just free kick master. Um, I really do that they like that they added these flashback cards uh, into the set. Um, allows you it, it, it definitely adds some more appeal. If you're just a casual, especially if you're a, an older MLS fan who's been watching the league and you've seen some of those guys play. It also adds some appeal for, uh, you know, like player collectors um, and stuff like that. Like, I'm a Stevie G fan, so, you know, there's an added bonus of the possibility of, you know, pulling a Steven Gerrard autograph. Um, although, I'd probably prefer I'm in a Liverpool kit. Like, because, duh, why wouldn't I? Um... But uh, it would still be cool to pull him or like Frank Lampard or Kaka. Like a Kaka autograph would be freaking awesome. Um, Wagner, that guy, and Enrique. Just leave up the, the Wagner. Yeah. Oh, I haven't been sleeping those up. Oh, well. I um, guess there's going to be just one sleeve and the rest aren't going to be. We got St. Clair, we have Miles Robinson, we have Velasco and Zawadzki. So nice ones there, nice ones there. And uh, onto our final pack of the first half, we got a Jude, a Stoichkov. We have a, ah, wrong flashbacks from LA, come on. Ashley Cole, boo. I want Stevie G. But that is a green, a 99. How long did he? Three year run, okay. Yeah. Pretty pulverizing player over in, in England. Cucho. He doesn't make my second parallel, this guy. Um, part of the Columbus Crew team that won the MLS Cup this year. So this is a Aqua Lava. I love the Lava parallels. I really think they look really nice. I like Chrome in general. I like all the parallels pretty much. Um, all the Chrome parallels look pretty good. And I think Chrome is just the best Chromium product out there. Um, I think it's better than Prism. Uh, Zawadzki to $199. I think it's better than Prism. Some people might disagree, but I just think the look of Chrome, I like the parallels, and especially in the MLS this year, they don't have a buttload of parallels too. Um, it's really, really nice. So, really love that. Ah, uh, I saw the red, it was like, come on, St. Louis. So our autograph is to 99, it's of Noel Buck. I think it's pretty good, I think he's pretty decent. Um, little player. I think he's a holding midfielder. I could be wrong. I know he's a midfielder because it says there. Um, but, uh, yeah. Cool pull right there. Good to get a colored autograph. You'll never hear me complain. Bro. I mean, it's possible to hear me complain if it's like a doo doo player. That's what I'm known for. But Shaq Moore there. Um, Nashville. We got a Nagby. Derby Stars. Or Derby Diamonds. I don't know why I said Derby Stars. Derby Diamonds. Here we go. We got a. Ooh. Come on, baby. Akinola. Uh, on the gold speckle to uh, 50. This is right there. Sorry about that. I'm not a huge fan of horizontal cards. Um, but uh, they have their place for sure. Um, Also, if the camera quality, if you feel like it's gotten better, let me know, because I got a new phone. So, if it's fairly, I'm going to watch it back and, you know, come to my own conclusion. But if you also feel like it's fairly noticeable, uh, let me know. There we go. On the, the 58 design for that guy. 
I'm going to say is that guy. Blake something. Another Christian Fletcher and a Lowen. Our probably best player uh, for St. Louis City. Another good rookie to get right here. A Fletcher. That is the uh, blue to 199. And on to our final pack of this hobby box. Let's see if we can't hit something crazy right here. Kramashi, Fender, and a Jesus Ferreira, and another Kramashi. So there's a Kramashi pack. And then it's just a normal old refractor, non numbered. All right, so that will do it for this. Uh, second box of um, Chrome. We'll do a quick little recap. Um, let me get all the cards together before. All right. So our little recap will start off with what our inserts were. Don't worry, I'll go back and sleeve them all up. So don't you guys worry. Okay, Wagner, these are non-sleeved ones that I will sleeve here in just a second. Here are our refractors and our one speckle was Craig. Craig, we got our fifth number to 50. Io Akinola. We got a ETN Jr. 75. Ashley Cole to 99. Cucho to 125. Zawatsky to 199. Fletcher to 199. And Juninho to 199. And to get up to the wall, uh, today's wall of fame, to 125, we have Kramashi on the blue, teal, whatever you want to call it. A lava parallel and our autograph to 99, 75, 99 is Noel Buck for the revolution. All right, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this opening and everything. Um, please like, subscribe, comment if this is uh, content you're interested in and you like. Uh, helps, um, helps me know that you guys like the content and you guys want to see more. Uh, I would definitely be trying to get some more stuff out there. Trust me. I, I definitely plan on uh, getting some Chrome Blasters one way or another and doing a rip of those. And I might, who knows, I might go back and get another Hobby Box or two or something. But uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully you guys' pack look is pretty good as well. And yeah, you guys have a great rest of your day. God bless.